Right, good morning everyone. It is, uh, it is an early morning. It's my last morning, unfortunately, in this little Costa Brava trip, but it's going to be a special day. Uh, I stayed last night in the hotel behind me, which is Hotel Camaral, uh, and that's the hotel, a five-star hotel at PG Catalonia, and that's where I'm going to tee off in about an hour's time. But arrived last night in this hotel. It's a five-star hotel, and it's pretty special, to be fair. Uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to take you on my journey all the way from start to finish, um, Hotel stay, off onto the first tee. I'll tell you what I think about the golf course along the way and hopefully get some great footage for you to have a look. But starting off, let's go and have a look through this hotel. In case you get the idea, everything so far about this is pretty special. Question is, how special is this golf course? I'm going to find out very, very quickly. Transfer is about to come and pick us up for a drive down to this PJ Catalonia course, and I can't wait to get on that first tee. Right, so I've arrived at the course, and uh, so what they do, pick you up um, in that little vehicle you see us get into, whizzes down to the course, which is actually two minutes away. The clubhouse is, um, that's the clubhouse directly behind me now. And like I said, you just get that feeling, I'm already pretty excited and can't wait to get on that first tee, because they, they just literally look after you from the minute you arrive. It's one of them special places, and we're all a bit, all a bit giddy at the minute in terms of wanting to get out on that first tee. Right, so it's the final day of this trip to Costa Brava. I've got to do this as a man versus golf hole challenge because uh, we've played two holes and already it's like this place is uh, it's pretty special, I think. Love the look of this hole anyway. Par five, got some drone footage going over for you to have a look at it. Uh, pretty much straight down all the way and straight to the hour bit for me. So just trying to stay out them trees and get somewhere near that uh, green in regulation. Plenty of water down there as well. One of them places where uh, it's hard to keep a smile off your face, to be honest with you. So as you can see, the greatest of tee shot really pulled this one away down this left-hand side. I've got a gap. I brought a few clubs over. It's one of them places where at the moment the fairways are a bit wet this morning and Buggy has got to stay 50 yards away. I'm gonna go in and try and get a six iron up and through that gap. I know, what am I thinking? That's a dig, that's gone right where I was aiming, which is a very unusual statement, go. Really pleased with that, we're back in the game, but I don't know how far that's gonna leave me into this green. Right, so it's got itself back in play, but um, plenty still to do. It's a real, uh, nothing left on this one. All water down the left-hand side, and plenty of bunkers uh, down the right, so. Only option is a good shot, I think. Let's see if we've got one. ride online if it's got the legs sit yeah happy with that one it certainly makes you think it was uh, you just got to commit to them shots and I did for a change and uh, that's good happy still smiling I think if we'd gone in the water I'd have still smiled to be honest with you didn't see that coming after the tee shot it was horrific but uh, got away with it two decent shots and I'm uh, now would you believe putting for birdie I did mention on the tee I think it's about stroke index 13 so uh, no shots so this would be a great turn up and we roll this in right to left 
I think two bold and after uh, move I completely misread that because uh, I started off on the line I was aiming for and uh, thought I'd give that a bit of a chance but it was a bit of a misread anyway I don't care par five and uh, what a great golf hole that is Right, next up on the challenge, it's a, it's a par three, it's a fifth hole. I think I'll probably record every hole for this man versus golf challenge. So whether I pick the right ones, I don't know, but it's about 185 to the flag. Plenty of water down that left here, and there's water everywhere. Um, but what a great golf hole. I'm going with five iron. I want to be well left of, uh, sort of left of center, I think, is my safe option, if I can do that. It's stroke, I'll get a shot anyway, I think I said it was stroke seven, was it? A nice strike it's probably where it's a little bit further right than i'd want but i think judging by a pitch mark it's about pin eye i can't quite pick it up but i think the pitch mark looks looks pin eye but quite a bit right happy though right quite a severe slope and a bit of swing i think off that right hand side i'm gonna leave the flag in just so you get an idea where that hole is exactly and um yeah take a two put from here any day what a great par three though Roll out. Now sit. Sit. Decent enough effort, but still a bit to do. Come on, decent put. Straight in the middle yep got it happy with the two put from there to par three on a shot which is uh, almost illegal i suppose but anyway i got uh, that's a win so one up for the average golfer Okay, final old man versus golf hole challenge, I promise you, but I can't ignore this one. It's on the 13th or 14th, very much a signature hole at uh, Catalonia. It's stroke six. It's just absolutely gorgeous. We've got to get a drive in play and then hopefully something fairly short into that, uh, again, another island green as I call them. When you got the ball fight, leaked it out right. Um, I don't know what's quite over there, but I think it's I think it's over. I think we've just been up that fairway, so it shouldn't be too bad. And hopefully I've got a shot into that green. Right, 157. Um, well, you don't want to be long or short, really. So this is going to have to be clubbed right. I'm going to go with seven iron. It's a decent seven iron for me, that. Got lucky. Bailout was definitely down the right, and there's plenty of room down here. But a uh, bit of a hanging lie. Come on, decent shot. Oh, it's not a decent shot at all. That's really heavy and in the, in the drink. I'm gonna take the shot from here again. Right, really, I'm not gonna finish on that. I'm gonna have another pop from here, because, uh, I love this hole and that's not the way to finish. Come on, and hit the thing. That's a much better strike. Got through that one better. Go, has he got the legs? Oh yeah, why didn't I do that first time around, eh? But never mind, I'm on dry ground. So what's that? Put for a five in it? 
Right, on dry ground, the, I mean, it's a, it's a tough old hole, simple as that, but yeah, happy to have hit a second good one at least anyway. And uh, this is for five, net four, you never know. I'm gonna leave the flag in again, just to give you a better idea of, uh, if you saw, before someone wants to give me a two shot penalty. Right, let's finish this one on a high. Go on. Uh, I was always just that little bit low. It was good pace, to be fair. Happy with the bottom, make a six. And uh, I was well and truly beaten by PGA Catalonia, but I don't mind, to be fair, because it's been a cracking... The whole experience from that hotel, uh, Camaral, I think they call it, they really look after you. It's top draw, to be fair. And uh, like I said, even when you chunk one in the water, uh, it still doesn't bother you too much. So, uh, yeah, spot on. What a golf course. Okay, so my round and my whole PGA Catalonia experience has come to an end, and it's exactly that, it's an experience. If you get the opportunity to stay into the hotel, uh, Camaral, and also get to play the course, it really is, uh, it's, it's top notch, it's top draw. It's special, as I keep mentioning. A uh, few images of the food that we had uh, last night in the hotel, again, it's very special, yeah, you get the idea by now. Um, I've just been to the clubhouse, I've played my 18 holes, have you seen from the clips that we've uh, put over there for you. Stunning golf course. It's, it's a tough track, but it's one that you really enjoy every minute of it. You've seen it on the TV, and it's nice to get that opportunity to try it yourself. Um, just add PGA Burger if you uh, get into the clubhouse again, which was uh, special. So it's all been good. I mean, I've just got not a great deal to add. Um, I hope that the footage that I've got across to you has done it justice. Uh, but if you do get the opportunity to play PGA Catalonia, I can assure you you won't be disappointed, honestly, it is, uh, yeah, I'll say one more time, it's special.